one is for Valerie from France. She wanted to know how traditional Bujin Khan techniques with weapons can go into modern application. So we start with a Hanbo today and we'll do a choking technique. But if you think of a Hanbo, what's out there that's similar to this? Oh, car antennas, uh, mops, all sorts of different sticks that you can find in many different places. Uh, sides of chairs, it gets to be interesting to kind of look at everyday weapons and modern things that are out there that you could use like coffee cups and stuff. So let's go with this for Valerie from France. So we have a Hanbo here. Maybe the punch comes in and I come across and do a takedown technique with this particular weapon. That's kind of a traditional technique where I've caught the arm, come through, I've done a pinch technique here with my forearm, and then I drop down with my body in this application. You could do some type of an ending. Then we get into Kasuri Fundo. So, there's all sorts of different flexible things out there. Seat belts, belts that you have on your own being, neckties, lots of different things you can come up with. If we do almost that same traditional one where we can loop this down, and take the person into a nice choke. This application, you can uh, have a towel on you as well and just bunch it up really quick. And these will work for that as well. They're very easy to do and doesn't take much time. That modern application with unarmed self-defense then as that punch comes in, I scoop up and I come down with this. So these are a couple different applications for you, Valerie from France. I'm glad that you wrote in, and I hope that you enjoy these. Please hit like, share, and check out our other awesome training videos on Ninja Training TV.